Hello, welcome back to Real Sushi Life Noting. In this episode, I'll be showing you how I created this abstract looking kind of creatures. Um, it's actually really uh, quite simple. Um, you can see I'm only using five modifier. Let's actually travel back in time and go backward. So you can see uh, displacement just give the thickness, subdivision just turn block into kind of like a circular. If I go back, get rid of solidify, get rid of decimate. It's basically just a, the default cube that has been scattered on top of grease pencil object. All right, so that's the trick. Okay, my grease pencil is a little bit super flat, but in reality, you can you can tweak this so you can have some kind of thickness before you go further down the line. Okay, so geometry nodes is doing some of the job you can see here. There's some something interesting here happening. Uh, if I select the, uh, the geometry nodes, the one that's responsible is this align rotation to vector using vertex normal. Okay, so that's uh, that's basically the trick. Everything else is just randomizing the scale and randomizing the position. So I want to show you the whole process. We, I'm using Blender 2.93, where we can have vertex normal. However, with 2.93, if I create grease pencil blank, somehow if I draw something, I cannot, I cannot really see anything. I think in Blender 2.93, you need to create a grease pencil frame beforehand I don't know why so it's really kind of weird um, so I go back to Blender 2.92 go to the front view create grease pencil blank and start drawing so you can make a character so by default of course grease pencil is only making like a like a flat 2D, but you can you can actually uh, make something that's a little bit more 3D. If you go into different directions, you know. So this is like super rough. Okay, that's a that's a wrong way to place the stroke, but anyway, you got the idea. So it doesn't need to be flat. You can make like alien looking character. I'm just gonna do it really rough. You only need to draw one side because you can always mirror it. Pick your axis and then apply. Now you have grease pencil with double sided. Grease pencil tend to be really heavy. You can always go to edit mode and then stroke, simplify, maybe fix or adaptive, whatever you choose. Adaptive, I like to use adaptive. So we can reduce the number of points. Now it's still grease pencil but less with less point. So let's save this as GP feature. I'm not wrong, I can copy paste this into the other blender. Oh yeah, okay, cool. So I have this one, this guy over here. Once I bring it from Blender 2.92, it's very interesting that I can actually draw, no, cannot. Okay, that's weird. Anyway, <clears throat> this is the new grease pencil. I just need to convert it into a curve. Convert to mesh. Now this guy is a mesh object. So I just need to copy the modifier from this guy. Select this. Select this. We can actually command L and link copy the modifier
Okay, this is still like a curve object. I don't know why I picked the wrong one. Anyway, try convert to mesh. This must be a uh, It's really weird. Object convert Okay. It's still Chris Benson. This one is a curve, so I can convert this to mesh. Object convert to mesh. Now this is a real mesh object. Select this command L copy modifier. Okay now it's uh it's working finally save this very quickly. We apparently need probably needs more curve there so we mm, probably subdivide put it up there so I'm subdividing the mesh to get more resolutions now we have this character slightly different from this guy because of the way I draw the stroke I think still however kind of interesting looking kind of like a bummy uh, we can try mirroring the character select this guy and do mirror we might need to put this in the center beforehand Okay, turn on bisect. So we have our character. Okay, apply all doesn't work for now. We might need to just use something like remesh or something, but the decimate should work and the solidify. This kind of add to the abstraction. So now the character is really looking like uh, something with a little bit more details. Um, yeah, so we have these two character now. So pretty weird looking characters, but it should work. All right, so, and if you bring this to Mixamo, if you're lucky, it will, it will actually work and rig the character and make the character dancing. Alright, so that's two abstract characters for you. Uh, hopefully you find this interesting, let me know what you think, and I'll see you next time. Thank you, bye.